We see it all around us more and more every day. People with power punching down. But the Avengers weren't like that. I believed it in my core. I keep thinking, this has to have happened for a reason. Maybe this is what I've been waiting for. Maybe I'm finally part of something bigger. Jabu, look! It's about time. Oh, These seats don't recline. It's so beautiful. Huh. Why call it the Golden Gate Bridge if it's not golden? There are so many other kids. I bet their stories are all amazing. Competition is what makes us strong. Mm. What if... They don't like my story. What if it doesn't fit in? It's gotta be perfect, you know? When you were born, your brother said you had googly eyes. What? But I thought your eyes were the most beautiful things I had ever seen. We are all unique, Kamala. You should be proud of who you are. I love you, Abu. I love you more. And I'm pretty sure you're gonna win this thing. Oh, could you imagine? I'm the winner for best fan fiction ever is Avengers versus the evil sewer lizards by Kamala Khan. And the crowd goes wild. <sighs> That's the spirit. <laughs> hmm. Promise me something. Win or lose. Oh, I'll always be good, Abu. Oh, Beta. Good isn't a thing you are. It's a thing you do. That's my girl. Folks, we're approaching the Avengers West Coast headquarters on the left, and we'll be touching down on the Chimera Sun. Hurry, Abu, let's go! Right, all right, hold your horses.
She's such a badass. I wonder if he's this tall in person. You're just a statue. Always strike in a pose. Welcome to Avengers Day. Hey there, finalist. Can I get your name? Kamala Khan. And this is my dad. Yusuf. The Khans. Great. Make sure to check out our comic scavenger hunt. Collect all five and get access to the VIP balcony. Once you've collected them all, just scan your phone at the elevator and you're golden. Have fun. <laughs> Don't you have enough comic books? But the VIP balcony, I, I have to. Pretty cool. Still hoping to see the real thing. It says you have to scan the barcodes to get your VIP pass. One comic at each booth. I don't know where to go first. The arcade? Thor's hammer? <laughs> well, I'm going to the ice cream stand. Mind chocolate chip? Ooh, please and thank you. Whoa. Widow's fight target practice. Looks like I need to play if I want one of those comic books. Hit the red targets, but not the green. 150 points to win. No problem. Remind me not to make you angry. Are uh, any of these low fat? I don't think so, sir. Hmm. Are we That's the spirit. Ah, oh, darn. Are you okay? No. I already got this comic. I need the Captain America one to finish the set. Wait, if you get doubles, want to trade? <laughs> sure. Cool. See you later. I wonder if Tony Stark ever worries about helmet hair. I am Iron Man. I am Iron Man. So cool. No, 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 no. I am Iron Man. <laughs> I am Iron Man. Yeah, yeah, we get it. No. 
This one's all out. Oh my gosh! Repulsor gloves! Oh, man. Oh. oh, this is so cool! Ah, what atrocity is this? Ah, apologies. <laughs> You're very small and hard to see. There is no need to cower before a son of Odin, though I understand the impulse. What is your name? Oh, Kamala Khan. Uh -huh. And what is that thing you are holding? Oh, it's a high-density muon beam. A Model 3 Repulsor Club. It's Tony Stark's first love. <laughs> Odin's beard. About as intimidating as the man himself, hmm? Oh, oh you're funny. <laughs> yes, I am. Behold, a true weapon that needs no improvement. Oh, wow. Whosoever holds this hammer, if he... If she be worthy, shall possess the power of Thor. <laughs> Indeed. The difference between Stark's trinkets and the gods' might. I guess. But every hero has to start somewhere, right? <clears throat> yes. <laughs> yes, of course. You are very wise for one so young. Thanks. <laughs> so are you. <laughs> <laughs> Kamala Khan. Hmm. I will remember your name. of thunder. Mind blown. Uh, comic books. Prize. Focus. I love your hair. Steve. It's fine. I have not. I shall all out. The shield cap used in World War II to smash Hitler in the face. This is so cool. You're in the way. I'm, I'm sorry. This contest should only be for the real fans. <laughs> hey, what makes you think I'm not a real fan? I deserve to be here too. You really think that the Avengers read your little story? Get out of here. <laughs> In the press, in the whole world, tell you to move. You plant yourself like a tree beside the river of truth, and you say no. You move. What? Who said that? A real fan would. Yeah, whatever. Get out of here. Great. And there are the comics. You know, for what it's worth, I thought that was pretty brave. Uh, thanks. I'm guessing you're a Captain Marvel fan. She's <laughs> off planet, but she would have liked to meet you. I'm sorry, you're Captain America. I'm Kamala. Kamala Khan. Khan. Your story had the evil sewer... The sewer lizards, yeah. 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 Thor really got a kick out of that one. Said they actually had a sewer lizard problem on Asgard once. You read my story. Everyone submitted. <laughs> that is so cool. Hey, Cap, we should head to the stage. Carlton is losing his nerve. Have you seen Thor? He should be here by now. Uh, I saw him. I, I saw him, yeah. Uh, he was over at the Stark booth, but he's... Probably not there anymore because I saw him leave. Who's the kid? Nat, allow me to introduce one of our esteemed contestants. This is Kamala Khan, expert on all things evil sewer lizard. Oh, all right. 
Hey, that thing you had me do with the storm drain cover? Pretty badass. <laughs> I mean, it's nothing compared to what happened between you and Madame Hydra. That was wild. <laughs> uh, we should head to the stage. Right. Nice meeting you, Kamala. See you around, kid. I'll see you around. That was Captain America. And Black Widow. I'm dying. I <laughs> job. Another comic down. Fashion of the 40s. Kind of silly, but so cool. Vibranium. Wow. Room. <laughs> ah, so cool. Thinking in this one. Dad, Dad, I just got to meet Thor. Was he as tall in person? It's taller. I thought you were getting us ice cream. You took too long. It was melting. So you ate it. You snooze, you lose. Guess I'll just take someone else with me to the VIP balcony. Very funny. Meet me by the Terrigen booth when you're finished. All right? You still owe me an ice cream, Abu. The Chimera. That's an interesting name. It's a Greek myth. The Chimera combines the most powerful traits of multiple creatures. Also, it looks like a goat woman, but, but I don't think they meant that part. Guess what? I just met Captain America and Black Widow, and they liked my story, and they read the whole thing, Abu. You met Captain America? When? At the booth over there just now. <sighs> this is the best day ever. We have to get a picture next time. Abu would never let me get my pilot's license. <laughs> but it would be so cool to fly one of these. Don't even think about it. But Dad, Carol Danvers was a pilot. And how many times was her plane shot down? Fine. Looks like I need to give it a try if I want that next comic book. Can I try? Give it a go. Come on. So close. Hey, almost worthy is still pretty good. Here's your comic. Oh, thanks. Almost done. The IP balcony, here I come. You should keep looking. Come on, guys. That's those scientists I'm gonna be from sick. the TVs. Terrigen was meant for the people, not some toy for billionaires. It still can be. Stay focused on what matters. Our work is going to change the world, George. I know you don't like the pageantry, but it will be worth it. He'll want control, profit. We won't let him. This is your moment. With Stark's funding and your mind, you'll be a hero to all those people. Can't you see? We are so close. Here you are. Bruce. <laughs> you disappeared this morning. There's always work to be done. I know, always. What is it? Nothing. It's some little thing. Just getting some strange readings off the... Uh, the reactor. George, maybe you were right. Maybe we were too hasty to put this on public display. Do you think we could run over the numbers just one more time? Oh, uh, yeah, yes, certainly. Uh, thank you. I'm so sorry. Hey, what are you doing back here? Uh-oh. I'm, um, I'm lost? Sure. Let's get you back to the main event, okay? Huh. I already have this one. Oh, 
Hold on. Maybe I could trade this one with that other kid. Hey, I got the comic you wanted. Awesome. Trade you. Pleasure doing business with you. That's it. I got them all. Now to get up to that VIP balcony. Remember to collect the five minutes to come to get access to our grab that balcony for the main event. Amazing. Look at the size of that thing. Director Fury. Director, aren't you concerned that your helicarrier's reactor might be incapable of containing this Terrigen? We know Trust nothing me. of We wouldn't be moving forward if this wasn't completely safe. The Chimera delivers the safety and protection of the Avengers and S.H.I.E.L.D. combined. Thank you. <sighs> Bruno's never gonna believe this. Oh, hey kid, be careful. Oh. Beta, this is the elevator to your fancy balcony. It needs your phone scan. Do you have your comic books? Open sesame, comic book overlords! Pretty big for an accident. There are no accidents. Thor, Tony, check it out. At once. Try to keep up. Grab the Quinjet map. Just in case. On it. Are you waiting? Uh, yeah, obviously. You're gonna let you catch up. This just got a whole lot more interesting. Let's make this quick. Where? Four. See if you can clear a path on the bridge. All right. Go, go, go! You got to get uh. Armed men out here. We need backup. Ah! You are not worthy. Tony, Thor, what's your status? There are mortals trapped. Not those small, angry men with guns. Uh, I just caught a bus. Maybe I should have had a bigger breakfast this morning.
Four! Thanks for the assist. We got civilians trapped behind those barricades. Understood. Stay behind me. I will deal with them. We got you, Thor. This should be fun. Thor, who are we dealing with here? They did not introduce themselves. Hang on, those guns are shield issue. I'll get Commander Hill on the line. Captain, they picked today for a reason. Agreed, Bruce. I'm staying with the Chimera until we figure out what's going on. to safety. Shield prototypes. Fury is tracking down the full manifest. Hello! How's the cat? Oh, tell Fury I really love being shot at with my own weapon. We'll keep you updated, and Goose is fine. Ah, I didn't know you were listening that far. You'd think these idiots would be running away by now. Can't shake the feeling we're playing catch up. There's something else going on here. Alright, the most bright idea was to dock the shield trucks with turrets. Tony! Alright, oh, fine. It's just peachy. I'm just hoping these guys don't have... They're taking it back. They've got Pulsar tanks. 
Cap, that ship's not ready for flight. Why is it moving? Someone's initiated the security protocols. The Chimera's autopilot has taken over. You'll need backup. We're heading back. Negative. Secure the bridge. Those weapons can't get into the city. Copy that. You're up, Bruce. Yeah. <sighs> are dangerous, Stark. Hey, those weapons were meant for the good guys. Is that supposed to be a joke? Not the time. Get your heads in the game. Cap, what's going on over there? Not sure, Nat. Seems like the reactor's malfunctioning. I'm getting strange readings on the monitors. Like we're being pulled to a heat signal in the bay. Down! Repeat that, Cap. I'm having trouble here. Nat, do you read? I need an up 
update. The reactor won't stabilize. The Terrigen's molecular structure is breaking down it into a gas. Something below is feeding energy into the reactor. It's, it's extraordinary. Take it down. Doc, I'll get back to you. Oh, the ship can't take much more of this. I'm trying. I... Tarleton? Tarleton! Avengers, do you read? What's happening out there? Uh. Avengers, report! Shepard in my sights! Shepard? Avengers, if you can hear me, the convoy is transporting a highly lethal sonic disruptor bomb. Our enemies intend to detonate it within the city. We're going down. I repeat, a sonic disruptor bomb. Secure the asset at once. Sonic bomb? Are you kidding me? I thought the UN outlawed those years ago. Let's have a look, shall we? Now that is an entrance. Taskmaster. Off, it could liquefy everything within a 10 mile radius. Well, what are we waiting for? Oh, my God. 
Together? You giving up? Not a chance! <laughs> so, where has your investigation left you? That you're not the brains behind this. And this smells like distraction. I'm done talking! Coward! What's the matter? Don't like surprises? <laughs> Next time, take better notes. <laughs> Guess you saw that coming, huh? You think you've won? What the hell are you talking about? Look around, Romanov. The world will remember this day. The day their heroes failed them. <laughs> What's happening here? The city's collapsing. Damn it, they played us. Steve, can you hear me? Get the hell out of there! Screw this. Ago, the Avengers paraded dangerous, untested technology causing damage on an unprecedented scale. Our beloved Captain America was killed during the attempted theft of this technology. Thousands of other innocent people died, and many more still bear the scars of what has come to be known as A-Day. Hundreds fell sick, encased in strange cocoons, only to emerge with dangerous, otherworldly powers. With no known cure, the disease has spread across the country, and while both S.H.I.E.L.D. and the Avengers promised to rectify the situation, it was Dr. Banner's testimony that brought about the end of an era. You so-called heroes transformed San Francisco into an infectious, gas-filled quarantine zone. You unleashed diseased, powerful beings that wreak havoc throughout our nation. Many still lay dormant, unidentified. So I ask you again, Dr. Banner, do the Avengers pose a danger to society? Yes. Their activities outlawed, the once mighty heroes disbanded. But out of tragedy is born hope. After the government liquidation of Stark Industries, Dr. George Tarleton, himself a victim of A-Day and founder of Advanced Idea Mechanics, thinks science is the solution to our nation's problems. I wish I knew what happened to Captain Rogers that day. But I was nowhere near the reactor room. I don't have those answers, but I can promise you this. 
I will use this second chance to make you safe. AIM will find a cure for the inhuman disease. Comforting words to those families torn apart by the disease. But is he too confident? Many criticize AIM's tactics. This so-called resistance army grows stronger every day. This is Phil Sheldon reporting live at the A-Day anniversary. Can't see the revolution right under their noses. Come on, where'd you guys go? There's gotta be a clue here somewhere. Hello there. If you get it right, copy everything. We'll find you. Now we're talking. Oh, Retro Stark. Do you have a moment to talk, Beta? Uh, yeah, uh, sure. <laughs> the girls are leaving for the mosque retreat in a couple of hours. It's still not too late to meet them at the bus. It was tonight? Kamala, we talked about this. Going to the retreat will be a good time to get away from all of this. Breathe some fresh air, laugh. Nakia will be very disappointed if you don't go. You're right. I'll think about it. Good. Very good. There'll be ice cream, eh? <laughs> oh, and best of all, no boys, so lots of fun. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, Beta. I love you more. But you don't get it. <sighs> okay. Where were we? Password hint. First love. Hmm. Oh. What? Oh. Come on, come on, you got this. Oh, right. Dang! Come on, guys. No way. I can't be it. Go, Tony Stark. <sighs> no. No, no. No, no. Oh, wrecked. I know I got something. Better check this out at headquarters. I really kicked the hornet's nest. Gotta get to headquarters and check out what's on this flash drive. 